Hi YouTubers, how are you today? I hope everyone is well because I'm making corn today in the crock pot. Step by step, how to do this easy, delicious meal because you can eat this corn as a meal if you want to. But I'm gonna have turkey chops, corn on the cob, and mashed potatoes today. Step by step, how to make this corn. Let's do it guys. Is this? I have about two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve pieces of corn here, which was cut in half. This is frozen corn. You can do this with frozen corn or regular. It does not have to be frozen. What you want to do is take and put you a cup of milk into the crock pot, and then you want to go in with maybe a third of water. Okay. I have some cloves of garlic here that I cut up. I want to put all of those in there. And here's where the trouble ends. Is some people say you're wasting your butter. This is going to cook in the crock pot for me for a couple of hours. And I'm going to do this, okay? I'll go with half of this. Not quite a half a piece of butter. And for my sweetener, a pinch of sugar. Okay? Once you get that all in there, you want to do this. You want to put your corn in. Let's put it in just like this. Okay. Okay. See how I'm putting the corn into the milk and the water? And it's frozen. You want to put your mic, I mean, excuse me, guys. You want to put your crock pot on a high heat or low. If you put it on low, let it go for about four hours. And I am going to add just a little more water to it. Oops, sorry guys. And do you see how it's in there? And when I come out, I'm, you can either use parsley or a little thyme leaf. We're going to put this on high for two hours, okay? That's what we're going to do. And I'll be back. All right, guys, I'm back. And if I don't hurry up, you guys are not going to get to see my corn because everybody's eating it up. Look, now this is what I'm going to tell you. See how beautiful that is? You can take and make sure you put for your sweetener sugar or honey. I use sugar, a teaspoon. Well, it wasn't even a teaspoon. Let's say a pinch of sugar is in here. This corn is so sweet. You don't have to put any butter on it or anything, guys. This is an easy crock pot step-by-step -step recipe. Hope you guys enjoyed this recipe. I'm going to have some spinach and turkey chops with mine. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. Gave you a little clip of it there, guys. All right, guys. This is how I serve the corn on the cob. Those are turkey chops, and that's my cream spinach. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and stayed this long with me. And if you did, don't forget to subscribe, guys. Give me a comment and a thumbs up. Have an awesome day. Voila! Try this corn recipe.